So here I'm gonna show you how I use canned coconut milk. So first I'm gonna start by opening it upside down, which seems kind of weird, but you'll see why in just a minute. Now that it's open, I'm gonna dump out the liquid, which is kinda of like the coconut water part, and it leaves the cream. And so now I'm going to empty that out into the blender. This is one of the main reasons that we personally like using canned coconut over other coconut milks. We still do use other coconut milks for some things, but the canned coconut milk is great because it is literally just, this brand that we use particularly, it's literally just coconut milk. It's just coconut in there rather than adding lots of other water and other things as well. And so this is gonna give us a much creamier uh, texture. Think of it kind of like um, a heavy cream versus like a 2% milk. So now as you can see, it is empty. And now the next step is something that a lot of people skip. A lot of people will just shake up the can, dump it into a jar, put it in their fridge. But the problem with that is that you end up with a lot of chunks from the coconut cream. So what we do is we blend ours in the blender. Um, I don't blend it for very long. I'll turn it up a bit, but I maybe only do it for a few seconds. It is possible to over blend it, but doing this combines it and prevents those chunks in the future. And then all I do is just pour it into this jar that we'll store it in the fridge with. And you can see it's nice and thick and creamy, perfect for berries and cream or in your morning coffee. I'll even use this a lot to cook with in place of cream. So give it a try and I hope this helps.